So hey guys and welcome back to Planet Zoo into our old Meishi Zoo. It is our safari boat right? so we're having a great time building that. I don't know if you guys are having, Get, put in the comments if you like. So we have this our little uh, entrance area, then you have the jaguar habitat, then you go to our otter house, and there's no changes right there. So that is the, the change. I made that alley. It's kind of cool, I think. There's rocks and things like that. You come there, you have all of that. And uh, there's only that that changes at the entrance there. And there is one little tiny change in there. Okay, so you come there before you come to the Cayman underwater viewing area. So it's kind of hard to spot them. Where are oh oh god, just right there. Okay, so and after that you come there, and you still have a really tiny area of space, like that much. So you just t turn that way. Okay, and what animal are we gonna put there? And that is the question that nobody asked himself. Uh, so we're not gonna put anything special, very special. So we're gonna do uh, the ant eaters. So as you remember, I told you once, once upon a time, that we're gonna make first of all only South American animals, and we're gonna expand. We're gonna see how and when and and all of these questions. So we're gonna come down there. Okay, so uh, yeah, we have the jaguars. That we put it first, then we put it the giant otters. Where are they? So we still have a South American animals. If you remember, we have the giant ant eaters. We have the Galap Galapagos tortoises and the llamas. I think, yeah, the llamas. So uh, without the uh, you know expert animals, so we actually made four habitats from seven animals that's cool so uh with the five uh animals uh for you know habitat animals of uh, uh our uh pack we also add the galapagos tortoises and the beds to appear uh so it actually makes a six with the white caimans and the otters it should make eight Okay, that's a tiny problem. We have the diamonds, the, the bees, the okay, what did we missed? Oh, we also have the capuchin monkeys. Yeah. How do I miss that? Okay, so uh let's come there. And delete water. That's something actually uh very simple to do. Okay, so and now we're good. So we're gonna come there. Guys, and we're gonna come to flatten. Your foundation, okay, and you're gonna go a bit like there. And uh, now, guys, I have one thing to tell you we're gonna go. Okay, so now actually, guys, I'm gonna summarize a bit what we did in our habitat. So, 
Uh, we did a nice little waterfall. I didn't support it because uh, it took me too much time to do that, and we had some problems, some issues with it. And the plans to put it was incredible. I used at uh, the backside, uh, you know, the same uh, area, uh, you know, kind of plants uh, between the bed superior and the other habitat, and it turned out to be pretty cool. I added more than two anteaters, you know. Like the bed step here, it was if they can't fight, and it was kind of boring to have only two. Uh, so guys, I hope uh, you liked you know this speed bolt and put in the comments if you want to do a series only with speed bolt without talking at the beginning and uh, you know as at the end. So uh, now, guys, I'm gonna see you not at speed bolt. Okay, so guys, uh, now. As we finished this nice little habitat, I found out that it had a problem, a really huge problem. Now it's not really, can't really see it, but all of uh, this area was deleted. So I just had to duplicate that and put it right there. It took me maybe half an hour because I had to delete all of the, uh, that, the track. And uh, here we are. We have three safari boats, right? And uh, now we we'll have maybe to add some. Let's add. Okay. No. Station. We want to add some uh, tracks, I think. It's called. How do we add? I don't remember how to add. Okay, it doesn't matter. I'm going to see after. So, uh, the habitat is a great success, guys. I hope it's saved. Okay. Okay, and here it is, our nice little waterfall there, and everything's good. Multiple animals are not in the temperature range. You? How? Animals too hot? What temperature do you guys like? Like, usually it's like 40 degrees, but... Two degrees more they are gonna stress, things like that. Thirty-three degrees. God. Wow. Yeah. They really liked normal light. Uh a lot of you know sun if you want. So you're just gonna add some coolers. And sure we're gonna manage so they don't be like zero degrees. Uh, okay. Okay, so here we are. We need to put it like 20 degrees. So, uh, okay. The video was kind of fast. So, that's why I'm doing these things in front of you guys. So, we're gonna put everything like 20 degrees. So, this guy's happy, I think. There, it's like 42 degrees. It's pretty hot. So then you have to put a temperature regulator. And uh, uh, I'll, I was going to tell you also that uh, the boat ride will nearly finish uh, the South American ride area. Uh, so uh, we're going to have another habitat for flamingos, believe me. So that's not really a habitat at the big entrance. And other than that, I wanted to tell you also that, uh, as we, I told you that we're gonna go with llamas as last animal, then we're gonna go with king penguins to make a transition to Africa, then we're gonna go from Africa to Asia, then from Asia to Oceania, then to North Asia, you know, Siberia, Nepal, things like that, uh, and then finally we're gonna go to uh, Europe and North America to go down after uh, from that area let me show you there and you're gonna go back to South Central America how so when you come right there you're gonna have there the black jaguar habitat yes yeah, so that's gonna be our last habitat so talking about our giant ant eaters I am really proud of that habitat we have many anteaters in there, more than two, you know me, 
uh, I like to have more than one. They actually don't really like this bangle being goo and things like that that I took from an other area we made together, guys. Uh, but it, it looks too good to delete it. So we're still having a lot of issues with uh, our uh, flamingos, but everything's gonna be fine. You know me, usually I I find a way to uh, fix that. So we had. Uh, we have a tiny little problem. Uh, that's a fixable problem, guys. So, yeah, we're gonna make sure it's gonna be good. So, how is the temperature? What temperature do they get? Okay, 20 degrees. The temperature it gives is the best, I think. No, every animal like this 20 degree. Uh, so, guys, I hope you guys like the video. Uh, put a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel so I continue this boat ride, and I'll see you guys for another video.